Hey, yeah. Right, get straight to this one. I'm guessing that most people think that when you're an individual, uh, especially an, a young person who's an individual, you're vulnerable. And there's one way, one quick, easy way to stop being vulnerable, and that's to fit in, because there's safety in numbers. If you fit in, and by fitting in, it's following social rules, cultures, behaviours, doing the things that the group that you belong to have set up to create. That's what fitting in is. Okay? So if I'm vulnerable, I learn to fit in. Everybody, you know, clearly that works. Okay? But of course, what I'm trying to emphasise here is that that's not the only way of becoming, of not being vulnerable as an individual. That's one way. Okay, and obviously that carries with it a risk of not fitting in, and therefore if you don't fit in, you bounce back to being vulnerable again. Okay? Now I found another one, so it's both, this is, you can work that way, or you can do it this way, which is be resilient. And a resilient person is an individual who develops their ability for making their own choices to a high level so that they have their strength comes from their choices. They are strong because of their choices. Obviously they have to learn how to make good choices in order to become resilient. Okay, and because they're making their own choices and they don't fit in, they actually, a resilient person, ends up being really, really good at innovating. They see the world differently. They're not, they're not focused on fitting in. They're actually focused on other things, which helps them make some great innovators. Okay? So, if you are an individual you're vulnerable, you can fit in, or you can be resilient. Okay? And that's fundamentally the choice that I faced many times ago. And obviously the choice I chose is this one, to be resilient. And it is a very, very, it takes a skill to learn how to make your own choices. You have to be committed to make your own choices, as committed to make your own choices as you do to fitting in. Okay? This is a skill. Now, as I became a parent, uh, what I did was discover that most schools are set up for this one. They try to get the children to the same standard on the same exams, with the same social norms, same behavioural norms, to fit into the school, which is fine. Okay? But there isn't anywhere, that i found anyway, that is set up to help young people learn to be resilient. Okay? So, if you are an individual, you can go to school and fit in, or as an individual, you can come to respectexchange.com and learn to be resilient. Now there's true choice. You can probably flip between the two, or you can just pick one, go to school, or just pick one, come to Respect Exchange and learn to be resilient, or flip between the two. Okay, that's it. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.